All right, so here's what I got going on. I have some great stuff, gap and crack filler, as you can see, I used it. So this can's empty. The can was about, if I remember right, about five to seven dollars, something like that. So the whole target isn't going to cost me more than ten dollars, not even ten dollars. Um, if I calculate the gas and stuff it took to go get some of this stuff. So let me show you what I'm using. What I have here is a styrofoam block, and I may have shown these before, but this is a block I picked up at Tractor Supply. Um, Tractor Supply, when they get um, trailers in, they ship these in between the trailers. It's a really light foam block. You can pick it up. My camera is kind of hard to do here, but you can pick it up with one hand. So what I've done is I took 36 of these blocks. I went and asked them if I could have them. I told them I had a project and they had a bunch that were blown out in their parking lot and stuff. So the guy was very happy to get rid of them. And uh, I took them, I took the great stuff, squeezed it in between each block, sandwiched them together nice and tight. Um, I then ratcheted them overnight so that they're ratcheted down tight so that they glued themselves together. So let me take you outside and I'll show you what we did with them. So here we go. What I've done is I put them, like I said, they're six blocks high, six blocks wide. Um, and right now I just have a Nerf football stuck in the middle so I could shoot at that. Basically, this is acting as a backstop. Um, I can put targets directly on it. I've shot this target from distances. I took five steps away from it, shot it, took another five steps, and did that um, six times at different distances. And the arrows never penetrated more than probably half the thickness of these blocks. I'm using full blocks the long way here. Um, some are better than others, but in putting them in this way, I guaranteed the arrows wouldn't go through. Now my intent is to only use this as a backstop um, so that my kids can shoot arrows and stuff like that. I shoot a recurve, so I'm not using a compound through this, but I don't think a compound, the worst thing with a compound would probably be that the arrows will penetrate deep enough that with the speed of a compound, the friction creates heat and will melt the styrofoam to the arrow possibly but I don't have a compound so I'm not worried about that one thing you will notice is I still use the Nerf football I really like a Nerf football wrapped in tape and you can see the guts come out a little bit as arrows go into them but this will actually stop an arrow before it reaches the foam behind it and it's only a few inches away so I plan on doing more tests with this as it wears out I can replace the blocks by cutting them out or I'm going to try using spray foam and just filling in the holes as I as I work out a big hole I'll fill it up and see what that goes so I'll post more updates and uh, check your area right now just so everybody knows this is only ratcheted together to keep it to a wooden base so I can drag it around it's actually super light I can lift this one hand as you can see it's off the ground um, it's very light I could carry this by myself if I need to um, so let me know what you think and uh, give me some feedback.